Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can set up the Google Pixel 4 XL for the first time. So first, press on the side button, press and hold to power up your device. Once you are at the welcome to your Pixel screen, tap on the language and select your language. There's quite a lot of choice here that you can choose. And then tap on get started. Next, you can insert your SIM card. So you can insert the SIM card on the side of the phone right here. And you can also download a SIM instead, which uses an eSIM. So I'm going to tap on skip for now. Next, you will need to connect to a Wi-Fi network. So in here, I'm going to select a Wi-Fi network to connect to. Once you put in the Wi-Fi password, tap on the connect button. All right, so once it is connected, just wait for the next screen. Now, so that this will uh, take a few minutes. So we're just gonna wait for a few minutes. Okay, on the next screen, you can choose to copy apps and data to transfer the data over to your new phone. If you do have an old phone, you can tap on next, or you can choose don't copy, and you can set up your device as a brand new device. So if I tap on next, you can see you can connect your device to an older Android device. Uh, in this case, I'm just going to go back and choose don't copy, and we're going to set up this as a new phone. Okay, the phone now will ask you to sign into your Google account. If you don't have a Google account, you can create a new account right here. So you can tap on create new account and choose for myself, for my child or to manage my business. So select one of the options. If you do have an account, you can sign in. So in here you can sign in. And then just tap on next, then put in your password. Okay, here I'm going to tap on I agree. So you need your, to set up your Google account so that you can go ahead and use Google services. You can connect to Play Store to download apps. All right, so we're going to tap on more, more, accept. And in here, you will be able to set your own pin. So I'm going to put in one, two, three, four. Now you want to set your own pin. So put in your own pin and then tap on next. Now there is also a screen lock option, so you can tap on that. If you don't want to use PIN, you can choose a pattern lock, PIN or a password lock. And then tap on next. Now I need to put in the same PIN again to confirm. Then tap on the confirm button. Next, you can also choose to set up face unlock or not. So I'm going to tap on more, more. And in here you can uh, set up face unlock. You can tap on the start button to start now, or I'm going to tap on the skip button for now. And then say continue setup, keep going to get your device fully set up or leave now and get reminded to finish later. So at this point, you can continue or leave and get reminder at a later time. And then tap on okay. Okay, on this screen here, say swipe to navigate your phone. You can tap on skip or tap on a try button to try it out. So in here you can swipe it across. You can swipe up. Swipe up from the bottom. So we can swipe up from the bottom. And so you completed the go home gestures. So they're teaching you how to go back and forth. So it said to go back to the last screen, swipe from left or right. So we can swipe from left or we can swipe from the right like that. And so here you learn how to, okay, so next one, switch, a swipe to switch apps. So to switch between apps, swipe up from the bottom of your screen and hold. So we swipe up from the bottom and hold like that. And in here uh, we have done it. So tap on the done button. And that's it. So now we can swipe up to go to the home screen. And we now have successfully uh, set up the device. And if you want, you can always swipe down at the top like this, swipe it down and then tap on the settings icon. So we're just gonna wait for that to finish. So 
we swipe down once, then swipe down twice. In here, you can tap on the settings icon, or you can swipe down with two fingers at the top like this, and you'll be able to tap on the settings icon in the quick settings panel. And from the settings screen, you can tap on finish setup. So this will allow you to copy data over. You can set up your phone to pay uh, with your mobile device and other things as well. So you can tap on the start button to set up your phone, uh, to continue to set up your phone from the settings menu. Okay, and once you have set up your phone, you're ready to use it. You can use the phone by making a phone call. You can uh, send text messages. You can uh, open up the internet browser to browse the internet. And you can also uh, view photos, watch YouTubes. You can send out email using Gmail that is ready on your device. And that's everything um, to uh, set up your Google Pixel 4 XL. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.